All right, we're going to be looking at your geometry class signing up for Math Excel. The first thing you're going to want to do is actually search Math Excel for school to come to here, just simply because there might be something in your history that brings you to the wrong website. And so it's Math Excel for school. And then this first one that comes up is go ahead and click on that one. Uh, here you're going to be registering as a student. I don't think any of you have an account. Uh, but if you do, you'll put that in here and make sure that you save your sign-in information. So you're going to be registering as a student here. So click here. And these are the three things that you're going to need, and that is going to be provided to you if you go on to um, Blackboard. I have provided these three for you, so each of them for each block. So if you're in A block, you'll be clicking on this document. B and G block because you have different course ID numbers. So I'm just going to be using block A as an example. It's in red up here. So this is the only code. It is the course code. I will be providing the access code. And so you'll be putting in this code for your ID. And that will be the one that brings you to your block A and that will be where you get all of your assignments. So this access code I will provide to you. Your course ID number is provided on the Word document that I just showed you. And then the next step for registering, you're just going to click this button that says register. Here, this is where you're going to put in the course ID, not the access code. Course ID, which is on the Word document that I provided. So for if you're block A, you would just copy and paste this here. So this is, once again, for block A. And then after you put that in, you'll see that here. It should say the correct block for you. So if you're in block B and you have A right here, you need to go back and put in the correct code. Now here, once again, if you're creating an account, which I believe all of you are, this is where you'll be going. If, for some reason, you do have uh, a Pearson account, you'll be putting that information here. Please make sure that you um, get me that information so that if you forget it or if you have to get a loan or computer, uh, you still have access. So I want to create an account. So putting in all that information, I'm agreeing to it. And yes, you are in high school. So we're going to create an account. So this is where you'll be getting your access code. And this is where I'll be providing it to you.